This is a 6 inch utility fighter that I make out of uh, CPM 3V and LMAX. And uh, everybody understands that 3V is a very durable steel, but um, LMAX is maybe not as well understood. Uh, it's a stainless steel, it's a high carbon, it's 3% uh, vanadium, it's maybe on paper not the first steel you would think of as being the most durable stainless steel, but it is remarkably durable and with a good heat treat it has good edge retention as well so the purpose of this video is just to illustrate the unusual durability of the steel now it's uh, it's pretty easy to make a knife that's extremely durable just by making it extremely thick but this is a uh, this is this was taken down to 20 thousandths of an inch edge thickness before uh, before sharpening and it's uh, it's currently uh, it's currently a little under 30 thou behind the cutting edge so this is not a thick knife and so I'm, I'm going to cut some cardboard just to kind of illustrate that, you know, when you've got a, a reasonably thin knife, it, uh, it, it, you know, it's a useful cutting tool. You're not just, you know, it's not just a sharpened pry bar. It's reasonably, reasonably sharp. So I'm going to grab a big hammer here. You're going to see a uh, LMAX at Rockwell Hardness 60 that's uh, relatively thin, uh, cut through a cinder block. And uh, I mean, there'll be some edge damage, but it's not, it's going to be a lot less than you would expect, particularly for a stainless steel. All right, so that, that is cleave that cinder block in half. And uh, when you look, you'll see there's some, you know, the edge is kind of scratched up, but you don't see any great huge chips like that. That secondary edge bevel is, uh, is still intact. It didn't go above the, the edge. And that's sharpened 20 degrees per side. This is not an obtuse edge. Uh, so here you got a blade that's, that's a little under 30 thousandths behind the edge, and it's sharpened 20 degrees per side. And it's just cut a cinder block. And it's a stainless steel, which to me is very impressive. Run it through tip first. All right now that was just run tip first through a cinder block, and you can see, can you focus on that point? That point did not roll over. That's a fine, that's a thin point. And it didn't roll over. It's not, I mean, it's, it's, it's still quite stabby. Now there's a, there's a little chip in the edge there, but I mean, overall, that's remarkably little edge damage, uh, particularly for a stainless steel. And that's what I think is unique about LMAX is that for a, you know, a stainless steel, uh, particularly one that's, you know, 1.7% carbon and 3% vanadium, and it has pretty good edge retention. That's a you know it, it's a high carbide steel that's that's good in abrasive applications. To see a stainless steel that has that degree of toughness is just really remarkable, and that's why this steel is becoming more popular in a certain hard use knives.